this is a dual box divisional break of heritage. Good luck. Otani, uh oh oh Otani, uh oh oh Otani, uh oh oh Otani. Come on, let's go. This music is like very Otani-ish, man. Uh oh oh Otani, uh oh oh Otani, uh oh oh Otani for this. One blitz mix left. That's impossible. AL West for Dez. AL Central for DB. AL East for Des Plains. NL West for Dez. NL East for Des Plains and the NL Central. Those mighty Cubs. That's for you. Diane Bailey. My main man, the Italian Peanut, is here. I found a cool Saints thing for you, Salvo. I hope you don't have it yet. Maybe you do. If you do, send it back. <laughs> One Blitz Mix. There's no way the Blitz Mix sold out. That I see. That would have been like 30, I don't know how many, 20 some spots. Uh, Italian Peanuts taking two in his, so. One, two, three. Litchfield was three. Four, five, six. T lock. Seven, eight, nine. There's one left. I'll put you in, Rob. Just type Rob to send me uh, 1350. We interrupt this. Uh, we interrupt this heritage break to run this mini so good luck everybody five six seven so the name on top here is going to get a blitz a um spot in the case break of tribute which i never thought in one million years there you go rob you took that last spot you hit it you clicked it you hit it sorry dudes thirteen dollars and fifty cent So let me grab that and change it to Rob's name. There's two left. Craig was two and three because he has gray spots. There you go. Now let's find that Otani.
All right, cool. Thanks, Rob. I got your message the other day. I know you want to meet up for lunch or something in the coming days, which we can do. Just caught me during tax time for the business and personal and lots going down. I'm supposed to meet my tax dude this morning. That didn't happen. Because you derelicts keep me up all night opening cards. You'll take what's left, what, of the tribute case? There's two left. What are you talking about? You ain't going to spend $270 on tribute, are you? We will. Are you in Naperville? Is that where you live? I forget which town you live in. If you live in Naperville, we're not. We're gonna have to find a middle ground, or you come out this way. One of the two. Unless I somehow get a listing in Naperville or something. Unless I want to go to that barbecue place, Smoke, I think it's called. Is it called Smoke? Downtown Naperville there? Barbecue joint? Relic, boo. Carlos Gonzalez. Cargo. S Cargo. My Cargo 160. Speaking of that, has anybody watched the Biggie and Tupac show on USA Network? I watched about the first, I don't know, 30, 40 minutes. Fell asleep. I hope they show more of Biggie and Tupac. It seems like they're showing a lot about the cops. I want to see, like, Biggie and Tupac, man. I don't want to watch the cops. That's boring. Q barbecue, that's what it's called, yeah. Well, you know where we can meet because I go out to Batavia sometimes a few times a week. I'm trying to I found a way to limit my trips out to Batavia, but I'm definitely in Batavia once or twice a week, every week. I'm always in St. Charles for something. So we'll work it out there, Robbie M. We'll have lunch. We're hiring. We need help. I told you if you work here, it's like working in a crack house in the 80s. I'll let you wear clothes, but you have to wear like short shorts. Uh, there's cameras everywhere. You have to bring your bags, have to be see you know clear see-through we have retina scanners but Nate needs help dude there's I'm looking over at the table now since he brought on Monday nights I mean it's Adding a whole lot more for him to sort. He has to come in and top load everything first. I should start trying to top load him on the air, but. Golf shirt and jeans, perfect. That, that, that works. We'll let you get away with that. Oh. Yes, Carter. How comes everything Carter chimes in on has to do with either butts 
men or men in butts. I mean, I, I can't figure it out. Whatever, Carter. And then again, he was starred in the movie Tickled. Anybody ever see that movie Tickled on HBO? We got a lot of new guys in here, Carter. They may not know who you are. Celebrity. Carter. Carter's in competitive tickling. Google that. Competitive tickling in the movie Tickled. Google it right now. The movie Tickled on HBO. He is in that. He gets residual payments in the mail from being in that stupid movie. That's how he buys his cards. Every card you see on his Twitter is from Tickled Paychecks. In that Tickled movie, of course. He created Tickle Fest. He's also a professional noodler. He catches uh, catfish in like the Mississippi River out there in Kansas City. Which I don't even know if the Mississippi runs through Kansas City. I'm pretty sure it does. Yeah. Has to, right? Nationals, Dodgers, Indians, A's. Gary Sanchez. I think that's a short print. I think my eye spies a Gary Sanchez short print. Number to 601. So I think that's him taking some action and hitting a home run. AL Easter for Des Plaines. Yep. Carter had a dope short print one of somebody and it was colored differently or something. Dun, 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 dun. This is the uh, dual box divisional number one. I'm going to be doing some fun combine social media contests, so watch for those. Could Saquon Barkley beat the John Ross combine time four of 4-2-2, four, two, two, I think it was. Oh, there he goes. That's probably the trailer with him in it. I only watched a little bit of it to see Carter in it. Like, I know what time he was in it. He's in it in like 46 minutes or something he's in it. And then he was in it again at 52. And I think like... In one of the trailers. But it's too weird for me, dude. Whatever floats your boat, Carter. Carter, remember that one time I trolled you with a mail day? Did you guys hear what I did with Carter or how I trolled him? I sent him a mail day, and I basically took one of those TSB specialty packs or that are about this big, and I put a card inside of that. Then I took that specialty pack and I put it in a yellow in a, in a bigger pack that was about this big, and then I put that pack inside of a pack that was this big, and I kept loading packs inside of packs till it was like eight different packages deep. But that first card was a common base something or other. So when he got it, he probably was excited, like, oh, what is this? This is dope. It's going to be something awesome. And it was just a common card that said, I trolled you. I trolled you, so. That was one of my greatest trolls. All right, I'm going to get something freaking dope out of here. I haven't looked yet, but what are some of the cut autos that are in this? The celebrity cut autos. Who's in it? That's what I want. That's what drives me to this pop culture stuff, too. 
Kirk Cousins will become a free agent March 14th. Where is Kirk Cousins going to freaking go? Let's get one of these coins. No, I know what we're going to get. We're going to get the Reggie Jackson buyback autograph. One in 244,000 packs. <laughs> a pack of 15 tops. Perfect. Theo is. You want a tribute spot? There's one left in the tribute because Carter is using his newfound Rafael Devers money. He's using his newfound Rafael Devers. Well, it's not a bad thing to get a triple team spot in a four box case break a tribute. C. Woods, dude, where the heck have you been? You are not allowed to leave for that an extended period of time. Um, last night, one Otani SP. We had a Clint Frazier auto out of this, and I think another semi-dope auto of a rookie dude. But we're looking for Otani autos, of course. I mean, the only auto we had was an Otani to 10 auto. I don't know if that's good or not. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, uh, pardon me. Pardon me. Where's my dude from Baltimore, hon? Is that you, Litchfield? That's the Braves. Black border. There's poop holes. Schwarbs is kind of in action there. <laughs> That's the chunky Schwarbs. Airbag 21. I already did the mini. Or do you owe me for the mini? I already did the mini. Are you? Were you in it? Who are you? Oh man, I would love a 69 musician. Sig, that would be that would never be sold. You know how you guys tell me sometimes, oh, I'll never sell that because most of us sell stuff, let's be honest. But there's certain things you wouldn't sell. I would not sell that. I would not sell my dope one of one Star Wars vintage patch thing, which I am going to sell it because I'm going to use that for Sanderson Cup. Matt Yerkes, by the way, I'm going to use that for Sanderson Cup, that Star Wars thing. I don't even want to know who's in the 1969 checklist thing because I'll be mad. Oh, so sorry, dude. It's the big idea 222 at Yahoo. The big idea 222 at Yahoo. 
<laughs> the right price. No, you would not. Would you sell them for a day at Yankee Stadium? VIP, super VIP style. That's horrible. I can't believe I just asked that. Who would who asked that? With, with Reggie Jackson as your host and Jeter. Derek Jeter and Reggie Jackson. VIP, super VIP. Better, better than just like upgraded VIP. Like full on presidential treatment with Reggie and Derek and freaking Don. Reggie, Derek, and Don. A day at the park with them. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Watching film. Hearing stories. Uh, batting practice. Maybe a little pick game of pickup. You know, a little four-on-four -four baseball. Hi, Dez. What are you sending for, airbag? Did I miss your name? Or are you... Wait, maybe that's... Maybe that's Litchfield. <laughs> For a ticket and a beer. Holy crap! Well, you're right. A ticket to Yankee Stadium today nowadays is probably, I mean, a good 150 bucks for a semi-dope seat. Right, Wrigley, you can still get in the bleachers for 60 bucks usually on a regular Wednesday afternoon game. Is Rich doing Run Rich Run this year? Remember, I wanted to do that, but I didn't. I'm going to do a Twitter contest around his Rich Run. Run Rich Run. Oh, there's Trouty. A freaking Otani decoy. Who has him? Desiree, you got the... Got the angels. Desiree got the angels because she is such an angel. You're an angel, Des. Oh, no. His oral cancer has returned for Jim Kelly. Man, F that. F cancer for anybody. Really, not just Jim Kelly. Robles and Stevenson shiny with the green dot. 1500. Remember to 999. Dent, 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 Kenta, shiny dozier. I want. One of those cards like Carter got, where the this is white. Of course, we can't all be cool like him. This this Robles. I think this is going to Beckett. I got to look at this with my loop a little better. I'm gonna take it out of here and look at it. But if this looks good, I'm sending this to. If that goes to Beckett and comes back nine five ten, that should be five six hundred, which is crazy to think about. That was a giveaway at Tops. I won that at the one of the panels. I told you that story, right? I had on your badge you have a number, and I was a number fifty seven on my badge. So like, all right, let's give away more stuff. Let's draw some random numbers for a oh, it's a David Ortiz one of one auto. Museum collection or something crazy. Winning number, number 56. I was 57. Then they called 58 later. So they called 56 and 58, and I'm 57. Then they called 57, and it was that Victor Robles card and uh, a couple other ones. Numbered to 99, Lorenzo Kane, Kansas City. <laughs> yeah everybody got hook hoodwinked on the hype on this one 
Now, now, in all fairness, Desplains, in all fairness, you wouldn't be saying that if you got an Otani. I'm just saying. Doesn't mean you still don't care for the product, but if you had them and you got an Otani, you'll be like, man, I'm so glad I bought into that. But I know, I know what you mean. But it is a fun rip. I do like this stuff because it, you know, you have to look at the commons. You have to look and see, look for stuff. Different colors, different designs. I feel like, did I check those? <laughs> Wilson Ramos. Let's see what's in our cool red things. I mean, our blue things. I got a case of tribute. We got the best tech mechs ever. We got some illusions, some Bowman's best. And we should be done. And we got a Dodgers, Cubs, and O's. So I had to go to the Dodgers on the left. Because it's a common, unless it was numbered. Boom. Bill Mambo Quet. I love the smell of these old cards. Is that weird? Is it weird that I like the smell of these old cards? It reminds me when I was a kid. I'm probably weird, so don't even answer that. That's that was a trick question.